three hours, night and flight. Now I just gotta sit and wait. So 
now I cannot forget to blow him. Okay, so. Oh, I was oh. checking you out. Oh, hello. <laughs> Am I good? I guess so. Always. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> You're so cute. Strip of boots. <laughs> Holy shit, it moved. Yeah, it is. And it's like. It's shaky. It's a little shaky. Yeah. Fuck. Like the nicest hotel. Are you still. Sorry, I kicked you. No? Yeah, it did, but it was not sorry. that bad, it's okay. <laughs> Does it have to be harder? No, it's good. Okay, sorry. <laughs> it was an accident. <laughs> I'm home. I've never felt so like comfortable in a crowd. Do you feel that too? Yeah, it's amazing. I love it so much.
know, you look amazing. Well, I usually, I'm usually, oh, thanks. I'm not more fancy. I love that uh, Killstar belt. Like, like I really wanted it. Has it. <laughs> like yesterday, I saw maybe six people wearing the same one, and I'm like, fuck it, it's a nice belt. It is yeah. though. Yeah, because we're uh, mine overlaps over yours. No. Yeah, no, we we just put you together now. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. We just said yeah. you're doing it together. That actually, you're actually, I like that more because uh, then I'm not sitting there alone. So. I was thinking the same. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. Thank but we you. just have to figure out because we also want to do interviews. Good morning. So. Hi. Hello. 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 Wir sind hier beim Mera Luna 2018, immer noch oder schon wieder, aber Sonntagmorgen ist jetzt. Ich sitze hier mit Beatrice Mariano, ich muss jetzt auf Englisch reden, weil sie kommt aus Portugal, sonst verstehe ich sie nicht. Uh, Beatrice, you are from Portugal, so we have to talk in English now. Yeah. And she is very excited because she doesn't do this. 2018 und äh, ja, ich bin stark. Oh, yeah. In den Tagen ich bin starten, eine der vielleicht schillersten Persönlichkeiten in der Ethnie. Gothic-Szene, Valentin Winter. Valentin,
I was here. I know them, yeah. It's a bummer, but. Oh, no. I actually didn't want to laugh, but I saw like five car accidents in four days around oh, this area, and I was like, oh my God. what is happening here? I wondered that's why you why just why suddenly laughed. Yeah, sorry, but yeah. that's one reason why I needed to laugh because. Yeah, yeah, what were you gonna do? Yeah. Every time when I'm in Germany, there's like a car accident. Yeah. So. <laughs> Actually, we've been lucky because we did. Was it um, Hearts Mountains? Oh, yeah. yeah. There, it's beautiful. We spent a good few days and didn't see any. Yeah, yeah. Some, some statistic or other that one in five cars in India have been in a fake road accident. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Wenn wir 
deutschen Weg in London seit recht angenehmen und ruhigen Flug. Ladies and gentlemen, for safety reasons, you are required to have your seatbelt fastened whenever you are seated on the fastened seatbelt sign is on. Please open the baggage racks carefully as objects could fall out. Now we wish you and us an enjoyable and calm flight. This is the day after I got back from the trip. Honestly, I just, I got back and I immediately fell asleep and I was just so tired because in three days, I think all of us must have slept something like four hours, two hours a night, something like that. Also because the day before we all got in the room and we're talking for hours before going to sleep and then when we actually went to sleep it was just fucking late but it was totally worth it. okay so apparently the ending of my vlogs is always going to be the bathroom door so uh yeah it was such an amazing experience to be there uh firstly firstly it's not my kind of festival at all i don't listen to the bands that were playing i'm not a gothic person i don't have a gothic lifestyle but i do relate in the sense that everybody has their own visual thing going on and you get to go to somewhere where it's supposed for you to be where you want to be and not feel judged or constrained in any way and i could totally see that in that festival uh, everybody was walking around with different stuff and no one really cared with what you're wearing. Um, there there was a lot of support from everybody who was there because you could see people who had like amazing outfits and people would just come up to them and say, I love this, I love that about you. And not only to the people who were like highly produced, but to the people who don't have the chance to create those things, you know, to the people who are more... Uh, simple in a way this is the wrong word and i hope i'm getting this through the right way meaning that it doesn't matter if you have a super produced outfit or not you're still gonna get support either way i was there and i felt like i was very um dislocated and um i don't wear the kind of stuff that the people there wear and i still felt incredibly welcomed the entire time i didn't felt judged and i'm sure that the people in there did not as well because it just doesn't happen there all you see there is just creativity and support for everybody and it's an amazing feeling um obviously the highlight of everything was meeting my friends and finally seeing them in person and i wish i would have like caught those moments but at the same time i'm not the kind of person that carries around a phone every single time and i'm not constantly taking videos or pictures because like i prefer to enjoy the moment myself and this is probably why my vlogs are so terrible because i don't do that but it was an incredible experience uh i was roommates with obsidian kurtu and she's just the most beautiful an amazing person ever um i also asked her if she could be my babysitter because i'm a shy little fuck and i was like uh so help me around because like i don't know shit and she was always so sweet the entire time we had so much fun as well as with valentine and um elizanth then esmeralda and I also got to see other people in the scene, like Lady Amaranth, and everybody's just so heartwarming, and just everybody's amazing, and everybody's just happy and supportive, and it's amazing to see that in person and to be with them. So it was an amazing experience to be in a town I've never been before with people I haven't seen before, and everything just turned out beautifully. The whole team was always very worried with us, always very caring, making sure everything was okay and we ended up making some cool promo shots in the festival that you'll get to see and it's just awesome, everything went great and I'm very blessed and thankful that they wanted me there so it was just a fucking beautiful experience so I hope you like seeing this whole thing I hope you enjoyed seeing my experience kind of a little bit and i'll see you next time bye everybody